YouTube, how you guys doing? Exile here. Today we are back for another video, and today we're not going to be playing any Call of Duty. I'm going to be reviewing to you guys my uh, SCUF controllers, or my honest review about SCUF. I've seen all these videos on YouTube bashing on SCUF and all their controllers and everything. I saw So Superior, I saw this other guy saying that SCUF was complete shit. Um, in my eyes, I don't really feel like SCUF shit. Like, everyone's saying, oh, your controller breaks within a month. Uh, so today I'm going to be showing you guys two controllers. This controller was actually my first ever SCUF controller before the Infinity. Uh, this is a SCUF PS4 uh, Stealth Black, so it's a matte black. And uh, I didn't really do anything to it except for that. But anyways, I've really had no problem with this SCUF. I got it at the end of AW. And I've had this thing for over a year now, and I've had no problems whatsoever. And uh, it's just been a really good controller. It hasn't broke at all. Uh, I never had to send it in. I never had any problems with it. So the only thing I can think of when somebody says their controller broke less than a month is either whoever was handling the scuff on the way to them, either it broke with them, or they just weren't taking really good care of it. Like they'd get mad and like squeeze their controller or turn it a certain way or throw it. That's the only thing I could take up or think of. Like I said, I've had this controller for over a year now. I had no problems with it. The only really problem I've had with this controller but they ended up changing it is see where the where the pads were on the old scuff I actually they actually were like not really durable they ripped really easily so I just had to rip them off the rest of the way because they kept bothering me when I was trying to play but other than that I've had no problems with it like triggers haven't stopped working paddles haven't stopped working nothing and then I bought this uh, this year before IW and Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered it's a scuff infinity PS4 Blue, everything, military grip. I like how they changed the military grip on the back. It gives it a lot more grip. It's a lot more durable. Um, everyone's saying these trigger stops don't work. Like I saw So Superior saying, oh, these trigger stops didn't, don't work as good as the Battle Beavers. But he didn't have them set to a certain way to where it was trigger stopping. He just had them set to the normal setting, which was kind of kind of ticked me off just a little, just a little bit. Uh, but other than that, the only thing I really don't like about these trigger stops is when I try to turn, I think it's my trigger right here, when I try to turn it, it's stripped. That's the only problem I didn't, uh, really like, but other than that, I don't really plan on moving it out of the trigger stops just because I have other controllers, like I have my normal PS4 one, if I ever want to play, like, any of the games except for Call of Duty. Um, the other thing I didn't like about this new controller, the Scuff Infinity, is their analog sticks. That's the only thing I really didn't like. They started to shred really easily, and uh, I think they're just rubber on the top. They're not like a solid base to them. So they did start peeling a lot, and I did contact Scuff, and they did end up sending me a whole brand new set of analog sticks, which shout out to them for doing that. They didn't charge me at all, and they paid for the shipping, so I didn't have to pay anything for these analog sticks, which is really, really nice of them. But other than that, uh, I've had no problems with this scuff controller. Like, the triggers haven't stopped working. Bumpers haven't stopped working. Everyone's saying that these bumpers and everything stopped working are not responsive enough. I've had no problem with it. So, uh, in my honest review, I still will go with scuff. Next controller, I'll get a scuff. Just because I've been with the company with about two years now. They're not sponsoring anything. But um, I've been using their controller. And I already told them on Twitter I will not go to another controller company. Because they've been really so good to me. And, uh, yeah, that's my honest review about it. Leave a comment if you guys have any more questions about scuff, whether it be the triggers or anything. If you're looking to get a scuff, just comment down below, and I'll try and help you out. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys go ahead and leave a thumbs up. It would help me out a lot. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys go ahead and hit the subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.